We're here at the Connecticut Historical Society looking at Connecticut needlework, women, art, fa and family, 1740 to 1840, which begins with this just remarkable blue on white bed rug, as they call them. These were the homemade, handmade, custom designed bed covers produced in Connecticut mostly in the 18th century. And there are other examples in this room. And these are really some of the most astonishing uh, examples of the needlework arts anywhere in America. This collection has never been shown as comprehensively, and it is one of the best collections in the country. One of my favorite objects is this amazing, cruel, embroidered uh, coat for a young man from the Talcott family. And you can see other examples of cruel embroidery here. The beautiful flowers and vines, and it is just extraordinary work that uh, uh, has been, again, brought out for a once-in-a-lifetime display. Uh, these are rare, rare treasures. And in this room, we have some of the earliest samplers, needlework. I love uh, this example from New Haven with a uh, house from the Mansfield School and uh, Norwich, Connecticut produce some of the more interesting um, samplers that one sees. That's an example there. And then the uh, needlework pictures that were uh, silk pictures that were done at the female academies in Wethersfield and in Hartford and elsewhere are represented as well in this part of the exhibit.